guys it's dona here i, I am a registered nurse and i i have experience of uh working as a nurse in several uh years so nurse as in i have worked as a uh, guest lecturer i have worked as a lecturer full time and along with that i have experience of working as a nursing administrator along with that i have experience in research field as well so here i am to tell you guys about scope of nursing so to speak about scope of nursing obviously first of all i should uh, tell that what all courses you can do after do after uh, for, to get a degree on nursing so that is you can do anm nursing you can do jnm nursing you can do bachelors of nursing so that is the basic and after that you can do your masters and phd as well so uh, this was about the studies so if i speak about scope of nursing so after doing your nursing what all uh, in what all sector you can work at so obviously first of all as everyone knows that you can work as a staff nurse in a hospital and again if you want to go to a education field you can work as a uh, lecturer uh, too so Uh, that that's something which everyone knows so i am here to tell you that uh, apart from staff nurse apart from uh, doing the uh, uh, being a lecturer what all you can do so that is uh, now we have so many field open for nurses too so a nurse can work in hospital a nurse can work in a, a it or corporate sector too which is a non cleaner clinical job so uh, in clinical job a nurse can work as a uh, uh, as a infection con control nurse a nurse educator a nurse can work as a patient coordinator patient executive and so on and along with that uh, if i will speak about education sector obviously a nurse can uh, work as a, uh, a counselor a nurse can work as a school health nurse a nurse can work as a uh, nursing tutor in the initial days and along with that they can be a lecturer after working as a uh, as a nursing tutor in their initial period but in it sector which is really booming nowadays so uh, first of all which is uh, which is very common I, you guys might have heard that is medical coding so after being your after doing your nursing you can join directly as a medical coder over some companies or again after doing your nursing you may you may do a small certification course and you can directly join as a medical coder along with that you can work as a medical billing a biller or you can work in a medical billing department you can work as a, uh, a, a in insurance claim officer in several it company who all are providing insurance to people and along with that you can work in research field like research uh research companies like research as in clinical research companies like uh, uh, uh like iqvia lab corp uh, again there is a uh, there is so many company like novo nordics and so many mnc companies and again there is startups which all are doing clinical research as well so being a nurse you can work as a uh, Uh, project coordinator uh, uh, you can work as a uh, clinical project manager you can work as a a clinical data manager you can work as a clinical research associate you can work as a clinical trial coordinator and so on so after doing your nursing it's not only that that you have to work as a staff nurse it may that you don't want to work in the patient side and it, like some people always think that i don't want to work in a in a hospital or i don't like uh, like patient uh, like i don't like the hospital setup to work at then uh, it, the, it's not that like if you don't like to work at hospital you shouldn't do nursing after doing nursing you can directly join in it sector as well so anyway that was all about nursing that was all about scope of nursing all the best do well